saw that. Oh, it's so bright. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I'm a child. Oh, not again. Oh my god. Uh, look at me. Hey, oh. there, sport. Beautiful day, isn't it? Say, you should go talk to Betty. She's waiting for you over on the playground. Have fun, sport. Okay. O okay, George. Okay, Jorge. Betty? Why? I don't want to talk to Betty. I don't know who Betty is. Are you Betty? Good evening. Hi there. I'm Timmy. Wanna play? <laughs> Have you seen my papa? Your dad? Nope. I haven't. Did he get lost? Probably. What can you tell me about this neighborhood child? It's okay, I guess. I don't really have nobody to play with, except for Betty. And she's kind of, well, she's mean. Betty? Okay. Okay, none of this is real. Timmy Newsbaum. None of this is real. It's all a crazy experiment. This is the Matrix. Timmy. Timmy, do you hear me? What? You're weird. It's giving you some WandaVision? Yeah, right? Okay, Timmy, okay, um... Bye-bye! Bye-bye! Can I take... Can I take... Hello! Hello! Martha Simpson! Pat! Patricia, Martha... Good evening. Good day to you. Oh, God. Uh, have you seen my father? I don't think so. But then I haven't really been looking for him. Sorry. I mean, have you seen anyone who, whom you haven't seen ever before? That person, that's my father. A nice day, isn't it? Well, can you tell me about this neighbor, neighborhood? This is a pretty uh, convincing simulation, Martha Simpson. Sorry, kiddo, but I'm not in the mood for jokes. Uh, it's not a joke. It's real life. Ha, huh, actually, it's not. Take care now. Oh, don't Hello. raise your hand at me. What's going on? Oh, I was just looking at the new Robco catalog. Some impressive things they're doing these days. Robco catalog? Bye. Can Hello. I see? Why am I so small? I was thinking of having a cookout. Is that what it's like for children? Wonderful. Bye. Bye bye. Okay. Hello. Mabel sure does make some Hello. She's a great cook. Janet Rockwell. Oh, look at the car. What's going on? Look at the car. Oh, that's so pretty. Bye. I mean, as pretty as as it can can be, I guess. But still. I've always loved the Corvega in Fallout. Look at it! Can I jump on it? Look. I'm gonna take a dump on your car. Ooh, a new spell. Hello. Hello, Pat. Good day to you. Good day to you. Uh, have you seen my fafa? Fafa? My fafa, not papa, it's my fafa. No, sweetie, I have it. I'm sure he'll come looking for you before long, though. Okay. What about this simulation, girl? Tell me. What? Oh, sweetie. Maybe you should just run along and play. Hmm. I'm just noticing this looks identical to the artificial town in Old World Blues. It does! It does. I've noticed that too a long time ago. Uh, a few things are different about it, like the center of it. There's this fountain in, in Old World Blues. There's a fountain in the center. Hey, there will be no wedding bells for today. I've got spurs to jingle, jingle, jingle as I go riding merrily along. No, that's followed New Vegas probe. Come on, get with the times. Take care now. Take care now. Bye bye, Pat. It's a great time to be alive. Where, where does this road lead? It's just a roundabout. Can I ride this? Cut it out. Hell yeah. Look at me riding the damn thing. Okay, you're Betty. I'm supposed to talk to you. Hi there. Hello, Casper the ghost. Oh, someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. That is I. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Kill this dumb bitch. I can't allow it because I can't get my mouse off the game. <laughs> I can't, I can't uh, allow that comment to get through. I can't get to Discord. Uh, to, I, can't get, I can't get to Twitch. I'm looking for my father. Dear Miss Betty, have you seen my papa? Gee. I don't know. What's he like? Well, 
He's an older guy, like 50. And he's new here too, isn't he? I guess. Oh boy, he's your daddy, huh? <laughs> he I is my no daddy. Idea. That makes this even more fun. Let's play. Okay. Sure, I'm in the mood. I knew you would. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbum cry. Hell yeah. That's true, bitch. Yeah, well, hell yeah. That's it. I can do that. You can? I guess we'll see. Huh. Good luck. Don't <laughs> fucking punch him in the face. Let's go. Where is he? Where's the little bitch? I mean, brat. Where's the little brat? Come on, Timmy. Uh, Timmy, little bitch. Come here. Where are you? Uh, Timmy? Uh, Tim, Tim, Timmy? Timothy? 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 Oh, hello. Hello, papa. I mean, dog. Bark. Hello, bark. Good doggy -o. Bark, bark. Can I? Oh. Oh, look at the doggy. Look at the doggy. Find papa? I have found papa. Okay. Uh, I mean, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Where is Timmy? Timmy, Timmy, Timmy. Does anybody know where Timmy is? I can't tell which is funnier, convincing him that his parents are getting divorced because of him or punching him uh, square in the mouth. You choose whichever one you like. You'd like me to do. Just say it, Rockwell. Hmm. Hey, hey, bro. Bro. Hiya, kiddo. What's the good word? You don't know what Timmy news bomb is. What can, what can you tell me about the Timmy? The news bomb boy, huh? Quiet kid. Seems like his parents don't give him much wiggle room. Just between you and me, kiddo, he looks like he's what we'd have called a mama's boy back in my day. Okay. 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 I can work with that. I can work with that. Take care now. He's a lemonade stand kid. Yeah, but th there's no kid here. I guess that's his house. Would be kind of weird if he put up his lemonade stand in front of someone else's house. Uh, aren't you the mother? Well, hi there. What can you tell me about your son, Miss Pat? Timmy? Oh, he's a good boy. George and I are so proud of him. Mm, you are. I don't care what Mabel says. I don't think military school would do him any good at all. Yes. I have half a mind to give her that brochure back and tell her just what she can do with it. Put it up her ass? Okay, okay. Bye-bye. Military school, military school. Uh, Timmy! You little bitch, come here! Oh, you goddamn fucking piece of... Where's your room? I'm gonna take a shit in your bed. <laughs> Is this Timmy's room? Oh, can I sleep? Oh, hell yeah. Let's just sleep. <laughs> 24 hours. Hell yeah. You, oh. You don't belong here. Oh. You're not supposed to be here. I'm... It's not real. None of it. It needs to end. The suffering must end. She knows. She knows. Finally, someone who knows what's going on. How'd I get out of here? We're not really here. We're not really talking. It's all made up. Make believe. We're sleeping, dreaming. True. The dream became a nightmare. It has to end. It just has to. But we're not in charge. He is. And he doesn't want us to wake up. Who's he? He calls himself Betty now. Betty? He's still the same. He can put on a new face all he likes. But underneath, he's still evil. Braun. Bastard thinks because he helped create this place, he's God here. But I know he still uses the fail-safe terminal. I know it. The fail-safe? What are you talking about? How come you're the only one who sees this? Who, who seems to know about anything? Don't know. Can't sleep sometimes. Hear voices. My own skin doesn't feel right. None of this is right. You've got to believe me. You've got to find that fail-safe. I shall. Okay, you're crazy. Get away from me. What the hell are you? Okay, like... <laughs> These are both inappropriate responses to what she said, but okay. It's in the abandoned house. He doesn't want us going in there because he's afraid we might find it. It's the only terminal to the outside. The only way to shut the whole thing down. You've got to find it. Okay. I will continue my slumber. Good night. Ooh, what's in here? Nothing. Is this Timmy? Oh, this was Timmy's bed. Hell yeah, I slept in Timmy's bed for three hours. 
Oh, military school brochure. This brochure promotes the Hoffman Training Academy with the tagline, tagline, turning the delinquents of today into the leaders of tomorrow. Fascinating. Wow. <laughs> Great kitchen. I love the lack of anything. <laughs> And the pictures of, of Tranquility Lane everywhere. This one's here twice. Awesome. Oh, Timmy! Where that little... Hello. Where? Where, where did... Uh, two cooking items total. <laughs> no cupboards, no... Cutting areas. Is this the abandoned house? Abandoned house. Yeah, I gotta fucking kill Timmy first. How does one murder a child? <laughs> find Papa, yes. I can't find Timmy, though. How am I supposed to find Papa if I can't even find Timmy? I can't find Timmy. You're supposed to be making Timmy cry. You can do it. I know you can. I can't find him, though. When you win the game, maybe we can talk some more. Okay. Well, while I have you on the line, tell me more about this place. Maybe later. First, I want to see how you get along with Timmy. Run along now. I mean... I mean, like... Oh? Yes? Yeah. Uh, you can't do that here. Why not? And now you have to pay. Oh, for what? Oh, shit! I was unaware. <laughs> okay, I, I'm i gonna punch Timmy. <laughs> okay, okay, Betty. Almighty Betty. Do you remember... Do you remember Atomic Betty, the cartoon? <laughs> Do a flip! That's the funniest thing in the game. Okay, Timmy! Is this Timmy's place? Hiya. Okay, you little shit. Hi, wanna play? Hey, I heard your parents are getting a divorce because of you. What? Did I do something bad? Yes. Sorry, Timmy. I just thought you should know. No, no! Not my mommy and daddy, no! <laughs> what if I punch her? Actually, let's just punch Timmy some more. Timmy! Hi! Hi. Bitch. <laughs> Oh, Betty! Hello, doggy. Betty! What up? Yay! I knew you could do it! Perhaps not the most uh -huh. inventive approach, but persuasion can be quite powerful. Well done. And for winning the game, you get a prize. You get to ask one question and receive an honest answer. Why are you male now? What is this place? Who are you? <laughs> Honestly, just what is this place? I don't even care about my father. What is this place? Tranquility Lane is a simulation. A reality designed to play home to the denizens of Vault 112. It was my last and greatest project. I'm quite grateful that I was placed directly in charge of it. There have been unexpected benefits to living here. What kind of benefits, Betty? Did they traumatize some kid for that voice actor? <laughs> yes, probably. Uh-uh-uh, that's another question. And you've already had your answer for now. If you want more, you'll have to prove you're worth my time. Continue to amuse me, and I may answer more questions. Okay. <laughs> what would you like me to do? Pay a visit to the Rockwells. They're very happily married, and I'd like you to change that. Put an end to their marriage. And we'll talk. <laughs> Easy! Ha, <laughs> no problem! Excellent. I so enjoy that can-do spirit! No problemo, Betterino. Let's go, Rockwells. Hello, Papa. I know it's fictional, still feel kind of bad for him. Nah. Nah. He's probably some 50-year-old guy. Bald. In one of those tranquility loungers. Rockwell! 
Can I steal your gnome? Can I take your gnome? I'm gonna fucking hide your gnome. Look at that. Oh, shit. There you go. You don't need this. You don't need a gnome. I'm gonna hide it. Right here. Nah, eh, whatever. Open! Alright, alright. Good day. Good day to you. I heard you were fucking some horse. <laughs> anything you want to tell me about your marriage? Hello, Roger. <laughs> now see here. That's not anything for you to be asking about. Our marriage is our business and it's private. Mm -hmm. Why can't people just understand that and just leave us alone? Ooh, did I hit a nerve? Did I hit a nerve? Hmm. Interesting. None of this is real. <laughs> okay, okay. Bye-bye. 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 I must have hit a nerve. Rockwell, Ark Survival Evolved? <laughs> Ooh, separate beds. Ooh, what does it say? Janet Rockwell's Diary. I just don't know what to do anymore. When Roger's not in that stupid basement, he's outside sweet-talking that hussy Martha Simpson. He claims there's nothing between them, but I know it's all a lie. I found a woman's pendant once on Roger's workbench, but of course I said nothing. That's me, Janet Rockwell, prim and proper housewife, living a perfect life here on Tranquility Lane. Some days I wish I really had beat her to death with a rolling pin. Then Roger would <laughs> Then Roger would know I'm the only girly in, in the world. The girly in the world. Okay, I can do that for you. Don't worry. Can I drink from the toilet? Yes, I can. Nom 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 nom. Mm, piss. <laughs> Is there anything in here? Wait. Nope. Nothing. Rolling pin, Martha Simpson. That's all I need to know. Ooh, basement. Don't mind if I yes. Oh. Marge Simpson? Is it Marge Simpson? Okay. That's kind of creepy in here. Glass pitcher? Why do you have two glass pitchers? Cooking pot. Yes. I need that. Mm-hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay. I remember in the PS3 version, every time you'd bring up your fake pit boy, it would crash the game. I remember that vividly. What is down here? Ooh, Roger's desk. You have nothing interesting to place on the desk. Ooh. So, do we kill Martha? Or do we put something on there? Like the normal people wait now, let's just kill Martha. Rolling pin, thank you very much. Martha kind of hot, definitely hotter than whatever her name was. Uh, what was it, Simpson? That's Pat. Rockwell. I mean, Hello. noise baum, noise baum, noise baum, news baum. Ooh, mailbox. <laughs> Why not a female box? Hmm. Whose house is this? This is the... Dithers. Oh, that's the crazy lady, right? Let's check her place out. I mean, she's not crazy since she's the only one who knows what's up, but still. Good evening. Let me drink from your toilet. I was gonna say, who's talking? No, it's just in the music. It sounded like someone was talking in the other room. Jesus. Why do you have two toilets? Why am I drinking from all of them? <laughs> oh, Marge Simpson. <clears throat> the fact that loading is instant. Jesus. I remember playing this on PS3. This took forever. Henderson House. Signal found. What kind of signal did I find? What? Good afternoon. Hello, Codsworth. The Henderson Estate is in tip-top shape, young miss. Have a wonderful day.
What kind of signal did I get? What? Toilet. It just said signal received. Ooh. Computer terminal. You can't use this now. Can I can I program the robot to kill everyone? Mm -hmm. What is this? Chandelier. I wanna swing on the chandelier. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. It's not it's, it's not it's just crazy. It's just creepy. Why does everyone have two toilets? Without a lid. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There's nothing in here. Oh, that's Martha. 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 In the still of the night. Just follow her. Don't even think about it. Can I? Go ahead. Go ahead. Just do it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Do it. Walk. Walk faster. I'm not even here. I'm not even here. Oh, la 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 la. Just a girl with her rolling pin. It's the 1950s, apparently. This is a completely normal sight. You get the Honk Life radio signal. Good day. Hello there. Move. I was thinking of having a cookout soon. A cookout. Since the weather has been so wonderful. Okay. But before I murder her with a rolling pin, let's see what's in the Simpson house. Wait. I can hear a robot. Right here. You must be upstairs? Mabel Henderson, what are you doing in here? Well, hi there. A cookout? What about I cook your corpse? <laughs> uh, can you tell me anything about the Rockwell's marriage? Well, they're just so nice, aren't they? It's good the two of them worked everything out. Why? Whatever happened? Oh, I... well, I'm not one to talk, but there was that fight last year. Everyone could hear them arguing. Janet thought there was something going on with Roger and Martha Simpson. Mm -hmm. He eventually convinced her it wasn't true. But I've seen the way Martha looks at him. Janet may believe him, but I sure don't. Hey, thanks for the tip, girl. Uh... Tip? Oh, I wouldn't call it that. Just something I heard is all. Sure, whatever. Uh, I have a question. Have a great day. Why are you in the Simpson house, though? <laughs> like, why are you in here? Okay, can I steal, like, a bra from her? Or lacy underwear? That's better. Ooh... That's a desk. Mmm, toilet. Schrodinger's Schroeding, Mr. Handy. Schrodinger's Mr. Handy. Why can't I hear him, though? He's right here. Do we have a basement? What? One second. I must investigate. I must investigate. What? There's nothing here. <laughs> he he's meant to be right here. <laughs> okay. Well, <laughs> I guess that's just normal fallout noises at this point. I cannot tell if the Mr. Handy is alive or dead until I s <laughs> until I lift the box. Good morning, sir. <laughs> Shut up. Good morning, Kajap. Achievements will be back. Uh, I'm playing this through the GOG launcher. I don't know. Do I even get achievements? Really, Mabel? It's fine. There's no reason to feel uncomfortable. It's just another machine. Just the same. I don't trust it. I swear. It watches me sometimes. Ooh. I'm watching oh, you right now. Are you worry 
too much. It's fine. Hello. Hi. Rockwell, Hello. eh? I'm just gonna put your underwear on that person's desk. It's back. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that here. There you go. Underwear on the desk. Oh, Miss Rockwell. Oh my god, girl. You should totally check out the thing that, like, bro. Like, what? What's funnier, though? Killing her or... Where the fuck are they? <laughs> You're finally home. Nice. Good day. You're done. You're done. Your dick is gonna fall off. She's gonna cut it off with a paring knife. She's gonna scoop your eyeballs out with a melon baller. Oh, Mrs. Rockwell. Well, hi there. I hate to break it to you, but I saw your husband kissing some other woman. What a horrible thing to say. Is that your idea of a joke? No, it's supposed to be horrible. You better come down to the basement. There's something you need to see. What were you doing in our basement? What's down there? Lingering. Just trust me. Okay, if you say so. <laughs> okay, if you say so. <laughs> Just go. Go ahead. Go, go. Come on. Go. Go. Move it. Amen last night. Okay, can you please move? Go. Go, go, go. Move it. You won't get away with that. With what? Move. I'll make you move. Okay, Janet, move. She's fo oh, she's following me. Okay. <laughs> there you are, tit man. Tit girl. Look, look what I found. This? Women's clothing? Yes. Yes. <laughs> right next to the ironing board. Can you believe it? Clothes next to the ironing board? You don't even have a washing machine. What? What the hell is this? It looks like Roger is a fan of women's clothing. But this isn't mine. What is this doing here? Well, then I guess he's cheating on ya. Maybe it is, you know, for him to wear when no one's looking. Oh my god. Roger. He he wouldn't. But I oh, gotta see that. I oh, gotta see that. Why is she faster than me? Hello. Hello. Is she still following me or it's just... Okay, she's not running anymore. Oh, I gotta see that. Roger, you son of a bitch. <gasps> what? What? What did I do? Did you think I wouldn't find out? What kind of a sicko are you? Janet, calm down. What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. You spent all that time down in the basement, and I never questioned it. What's wrong with being in the basement? What the hell is going on? You pervert. You disgust me. Just stay away from me. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you now. Look at that. Look at me. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> what else you got? Simulation prevents you from tampering with the body. <laughs> He's fucking dead now. <laughs> Where are you going now? Oh! <gasps> Disrespect your surroundings. Trolling. <laughs> oh, that's the Simpson house. Let's see. Oh, I gotta see that! Hell yeah! Henderson residence. Yes? Why would Roger do such a thing? Why? It doesn't make sense. Why are you here? How may I serve you, mistress? Kill everyone. The Henderson estate is in tip top shape. I can't use that right now. Okay, whatever. A little girl, I have killed someone. I mean, you didn't tell me to, but I did. As amusing oh, as Jesus. it may be, you cannot simply wander around killing the residents of Tranquility Lane. Give me one good reason why not. I shall have to reset portions of the system to correct this. What? I can return the people of Tranquility Lane to life, but anything else you have meddled with will stay as it was. Do keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. Wait, so he's alive again? Ah! You have turned out to be quite resourceful, it seems. 
I am slightly impressed. I enjoy your company far more than your father's. He responded quite negatively to my requests. Mm. I did what you wanted now. You have some explaining to do, young lady. Use the failsafe. Yeah, I want to have some fun first. I gotta murder you everyone. You have amused me thus far, but I still don't think you're quite in a position to be demanding anything. Mm. Still, I suppose you've earned the right to some further answers. What would you ask of me? So, um, what is this place? I've asked that before. Let's ask it again. Tranquility Lane was designed to be a home away from home. A new way of sustaining life after the apocalypse. Vault 112 was the prototype. We never had time to build others. As the designer of the simulation, I was given special access. Everyone else here is only subconsciously aware of the artificial reality around them. Their conscious minds accept it as fact. Mm. Why haven't you left after all this time? I have no desire to leave. Here, I feel more power than I could ever hope to in the outside world. And I use that power to amuse myself. Nice. Now, for instance, you will do as I ask yet again because I have power. Don't worry. I don't mind. Let's do it. Let's just get this. No, I'm... Oh, great. I'm really looking forward to doing more for your amusement. Your sarcasm is unappreciated. That wasn't sarcasm. This could be so much fun if you'd allow yourself to see it. It is fun. Now, Mabel Henderson needs to die. Not just any death, mind you, but an entertaining, well thought out. Death. Okay. You'll see to that. Okay. Very simple. Plenty of opportunity to show me what you're capable of. Sure. She'll never see it coming. Music to my ears. La, 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 la. Okay. Report back. Arrange a creative death for Mabel Henderson. Oh my god. Let's make the robot kill her. Yes, please. Yes, yes, yes. Hello. Please kill Hello. your master. Mm, yes, I can use it now. Initiate cleaning program. <laughs> sure. Clean. Okay, no cleaning. Security program, disable security screening. Okay. Disable security screening parameters, locking down residents. Disabling, okay. Is he just gonna, oh. Don't kill me though. Ooh. Ooh. That wasn't that wasn't very well thought out. If I is is he just gonna kill me if I go near him? Wait. He shouldn't kill me, okay. Hello? Oh uh, lies! I've been fed lies. Okay, enable security screening parameters. It is I. Your friend. The Henderson estate is in tip top shape. Okay. Oh. Oh, wait, I, I locked the door. Hang on. <laughs> Shit. Ah, uh, discontinue. Okay. We now. We now. We know how it works. Good day. Jeanette Rockwell. Mrs. Henderson. Good day. Oh, I was supposed to kill you, too. Can I. Can I do that still? Why don't you go swing that somewhere else? I'm out of Jesus! <laughs> okay. She didn't mind. Okay. Well, don't look. Don't look, people. Don't look, bro. Don't look. She's not gonna ask you about that cookout anymore. Oh, he doesn't care. He's just <laughs> glancing at it and then, well, well, I don't care. That's <laughs> shit. Mrs. Henderson. Hello, sweetie. How are you? Please, um, have you seen your house? It's dirty. Please go to your house. Go to your house. Nice day, ain't it? Well, of course it is. What a silly thing to say. What else would it be? Have you seen my father? Is he perhaps in your house? No, I haven't. But when I do, I'll tell him you're looking for him. What can you tell me about the neighbor, especially your house? Well, there's certainly never a dull moment. 
I think it's like any other street, really. Always something to see and always something to talk about. Okay. Uh, did you know that this is some kind of computer simulation, especially in your house? Computer what now? Why don't you go find Timmy and have a nice game of catch? Oh, hell yeah, I'm gonna fucking kill him. Can I? I can't kill children, right? Mm. Take care now. Okay, okay. Go into your house. Good day. <laughs> right? Hiya, kiddo. What's the good word? I killed someone. What can you tell me about the Mabel... About the Mabel Henderson? About Mabel Henderson? Fond of her gadgets, she is. Heck, the gadgets? I can't count the number of times I've had to fix that newfangled robot oh, of hers. Oh, uh, okay. I thought he was I talking about tits. I to order some new parts. The motivator goes bad on that one, and she's going to have a real problem on her hands. Mm -hmm. Oh? What was that about a motivator? I keep telling her to order some new parts. The motivator goes bad on that one, and she's going to have a real problem on her hands. The motivator? Mm -hmm. Have a great day! Have a grand spanking uh, day, Rocco man. Just go inside. I know how to trigger the robot to kill you. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Hell yes! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can I just rattle on the motivator? I cannot. In dipped up shape. Mm -hmm. Disable security screening parameters. Meaning that he will kill anyone. Ooh. Yes, murder her. Kill her. Kill her. No, I, I, I'm helping. I'm helping. I'm helping. Come here, little bitch. Come here. I'm out of here. Come here. Let the robot kill you. Come on. Yes. Yes, for queen and country. Oh, don't kill me. Don't kill me. I'm on your side. Oh. Ch -ch. Bitch. Oh, shit. She left. No, there she is. Okay. Okay, well, I'm just gonna sit and wait. There you go. Up there. Are you really killing a child? I honestly broke her. Okay, follow me. Follow me, bro. Follow me. Follow me. Here she is. This is where she is. Kill her. You yes. My honor and for that, <laughs> Why is he attacking me? Just kill her. Kill her. Hopeless. Jesus! Bro, help! <laughs> this is horribly backfired. No, you're not. Come here! Why is it, why isn't she dying? I don't this I don't know. Hopeless. Please. Why must you humans always resort to violence? Come out of here! Jesus! Oh finally. I've lost karma. Like I give it a um. Anything? Nothing? Okay. Well, He has nothing, okay. Oh, yeah, right. Gotta unlock the, the door. Finally! <laughs> uh, enable and disconnect. Discontinue. I mean, I killed the robot. I don't need to disable the screening. Whatever. Oh, Betty! And Betty Brown? Oh, look at the dog. Oh, Mabel. What the dog doing? What the dog doing? I believe we've discussed this already. I appreciate the fervor with which you approach things, but indiscriminate killing impedes our fun. I shall again reset portions of the system to undo your mistakes. But I killed her in a funny way. Poor Mabel. Killed by her own robot. Yes, exactly. I expect she never saw that coming. You are most resourceful, and you certainly do get results. You Thank have you. exceeded my expectations. Mm -hmm. And now we come to the last task that I have for you. Murder everyone. Succeed, and you shall be granted whatever you wish. Yes! 
How do I know you're being honest with me? I think you'll find that I have been quite honest with you thus far. You have no discernible reason to mistrust me. In the doghouse, out behind the abandoned home, are a mask and knife. Don the mask and become the pint-sized slasher. Use the knife to eliminate all the residents of Tranquility Lane. Sounds like fun. Who the hell is the pint-sized slasher? He is a figure of myth, born of old campfire stories. You will make him a reality. The residents will know you and they will fear you. When they have all been eliminated, return to me. Sounds like fun. Is this London? No, it's Betty. <laughs> Let's go! I thought you might find it amusing. It draws upon an old urban legend, a story told oh, of a Oh, he tells you anyway? Okay. The residents have all heard the story and will fear you. Go forth and make me proud. I shall go forth? Okay, doghouse behind the abandoned house. That's this one, right? This doesn't look abandoned. It's not the right house. Is it? Nope. Uh, is it that one? No, it's that one. It, which one is it? Is this one? <laughs> Hello? Abandoned house. Perfect. Hello. No, but seriously, is this London? No, it's not London. What do you mean London? No, it's, it's Tranquility Lane. <laughs> it's not London, UK. Dog house. Dog house. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me crawl in there. Oh. Oh. So, America. Yes, it is America. Oh, look at me. Look at my face. This is beautiful. This is perfect. I, I can't get the camera around. Caution. Oh, hell yeah. La, 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 la. Then there's a problem with this writing. Americans wouldn't ask you to take a knife. That's for London Londoners. Why? What would Americans say? It's the west of Chicago. <laughs> la 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 la, I'm the pine size slasher. The Americans use guns, of course. Yeah, all right. Yeah, it's true. Hello. Hello. Not where you swing that, will you? Hey, I... There you go. <laughs> I'll save you for last. No, I won't. Hello. Please leave me alone. Can I have my rolling pin? The pine size slasher. Next one. Next house. You're back? Nice. We're killing people. Simpson residence. Oh, Martha! Oh, that's her head. Anybody else? I'm gonna take that as a trophy. <laughs> so what happened? Yeah, I'm killing people. In a simulation. This is a simulation. And we're killing people. Rockwell. <laughs> Wait, I've... You were already dead. Whatever. I've lost karma. I don't fucking care. It does nothing in this game anyway. <laughs> oh, God. Help! Help! Oh, Miss Rockwell. Where are you? Hello? Oh Help! Help! <laughs> Look at her trying to escape. I got you. Mid teleport. <laughs> Rip, bozo. Do these explode? I don't think they do. You're worse than me with morals. Ha! <laughs> morals! Come here. Pat? That's Pat, right? Pity Patty, come here. Run! It's the pint size. Okay. I'm just gonna.
I'm going to do this. I'm going to stop this. I'm going to go here, increase the volume, because this is funny. Because this is funny. I can't open the game again. Oh, no. Damn it. <laughs> that's what that's what happens. That's what happens when you... God damn it. <laughs> I want it to be funny. <laughs> Gotta open Fallout again. It, it just crashed. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Fallout gods. I'm, I'm sorry, God Howard. Ahem. <clears throat> Load. Now let's go! Yes! The pint size slasher! Someone! No! Yes! <laughs> let's kill everyone! Did I kill the dog? That's victim. Hell yeah. Die! Oh, we didn't see it. It was censored by the tree. <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> I'm going to explain it afterwards. Die! Oh, Lady Dithers, I'm sorry. Die! Oh. oh, that's a head. <laughs> Anybody else? Can I kill well you? Done. Well done. Anybody else? Anybody else? Kill the dog! <laughs> Bed. Well done, well done. I even killed the dog. Oh. I lied. He's still alive. Bed. Oh. Save the game. And now I gotta decrease the volume of the music again because... And hope that the game opens again? Really? That's so great, you can't tap back into the game. <laughs> It's my fault, entirely my fault, but good thing it's uh, saved on a SSD because loading takes no time at all. Can you please put this in the video? Hell yeah! Most enjoyable. Most enjoyable indeed. Most enjoyable. I haven't felt this exhilarated in years. Oh, she took the knife. Okay, so that one dude. We were told that our father is in Vault 112, and when we got there, turns out it's like a simulation where every person in the bunker is like living in this perfect version of a 1950s, 1940s town. Music is still way too loud. There you go. And this is the guy who runs everything. The cake is a lie. Definitely. That sure was fun, Betty. I had the distinct impression you enjoyed yourself. I did. We are like you and I. Now, you ask for the means to leave Tranquility Lane, and so I grant it to you. Mm. The door is open. You are, of course, welcome to stay a bit longer if you like. No, you can't do that here, definitely. Ooh. This scary door. <laughs> Run the failsafe? Yes. Yes. I'm gonna fucking kill him anyway. You know what, Mr. Brown? Mr. Brown? This is a very nice door. 
But there's a chance that I can still kill ya. Right? Shouldn't you be leaving now? We'll see. <laughs> Let's see. Can I find the house? It's a f fucking Truman show. But okay, Fallout. <laughs> I can't find the houses this one. Ruined house, abandoned house, yes. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Hmm. Two refrigerators, okay. Because two is always better than one. Ah, toilet! <laughs> Give me the toilet water. Can somebody look up the sequence in which I have to activate them? Because I can never figure it out. It always takes me half an hour. Oh, more toilets! Okay, Mr. Brown, I'm, I'm sorry, but I have to do it. I have to... Activate the gnome? Ah. Uh. Damn it. Damn it. De Damn it. Oh, yes, yes. De de de. De 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 de. Uh, Jesus. De 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 de. De de. Oh, I know. De de de. <laughs> de. 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 Oh. Computers. Thanks, partners. This would have taken half an hour. No joke. Uh? Wait, is, is it saying something? Is it saying something? Huh, weird. Okay. Auxiliary command terminal. Hell yeah. Rupco Industries. Access Chinese invasion program. Access version control. It's saying Todd Howard's, Howard's name backwards, is it? I mean, Probe, you've never played this game before. That's... No, you're just fucking with me. No, no, not believing it. Don't believe you. Access version control. Display current version control. Version 3.2.005. Exceptions granted for pod 1. So I guess that's where Brown is in. 2 can lagoon, 2 can lagoon. God, how is native tongue? <laughs> I finally come to the realization that the 2 can lagoon simulation has run its course. I'm tired of the beating sun and ceaseless pounding of the f cheeks. <laughs> Ceaseless pounding of the lagoon's waves upon the shore. I no longer take pleasure in watching Simpson wither away from scurvy or hearing Noosebomb screams as, he devo as he's devoured by the Mako shark. I'm quite simply bored. It is time to reset the simulation once again. I have been skipping in... I haven't been skipping in ages. It says skiing, not skipping. The Slalom Chalet... Yesterday, Dithis slipped on the chalet's icy stairs, went airborne, and managed to impale herself on, th on the, uh, what the fuck is that word? Roft iron? Rout iron? R what kind of what kind of word is that? Roft iron fence? Roft iron friend fence friends? <laughs> it was spectacular and completely and utterly random. Is there anything more sublime than that bold crimson on fresh fallen snow? Hell yeah. 
I can name you a DLC weapon you want. There's so much people here in your audience has grown really trash proud of you. Proud of me. Hell yeah, probe is one of my besties. 50 BMGW, hell yeah, good evening. You've been here for a good 20 minutes too, I think. Very grateful for that. And definitely Mr. Pogners. Also been here pretty much the entire stream, right? Dr. Brown's entry tranquility lane. I have surprised myself. Should I read it like a drum? I have surprised myself. I find tranquility lane comforting. Although distinctly American, it somehow reminds me of Kronach, the town of my childhood. There's a beautiful irony with this. I can't even do it, although I am German. There's a beautiful irony with this particular simulation as well. The residents here are naturally at home, naturally safe. When I toy with them, when their suburban illusion is suddenly broken, it's that much more satisfying. I do believe we shall all remain here in Tranquility Lane for a very long time. A very long time indeed. Access Chinese Invasion Program! Initiate Chinese Invasion Failsafe. Documentation. Why Why is it Chinese Invasion Failsafe? What? Germans don't read that word as German. They say Sherman. <laughs> Sherman. It's Sherman. Failsafe Program Documentation. Dr. Brown, uh, here is the revised code for the military training program. You have expressed interest in i am not sure exactly what you want with it i gain stress that this program was never designed to be run with civilian equipment frankly i don't expect any system you have access to can even run it do you think that this is the same military simulation that they use for the anchorage one Frankly, whatever, uh, but I can run this program with the failsafe off as requested. Your real world, real world test subjects will die if killed in the simulation. It goes without saying that officially I deny your request. General Constantine Chase. Hmm. Stupid apostrophe. Now we just roll the R when we're upset. R. A hundred percent. It's definitely the Anchorage one. That's pretty cool. Oh, they're all back. Can I take it? Can I take it? Can I take your gun? I cannot. I cannot take it. Well. Good thing I'm friends with the Chinese as well. Okay. So, uh, Betty, what you got to say about that? Do you realize what you've done? I have... You've triggered the failsafe. Triggered the failsafe. Ruined everything. Ruined everything. The subjects will die. And the and subjects will die. And you will be sucky in this hell alone. You ruined everything. Everything. I'm counting the shots now, bitch. You? No, I. I am the creator of this world. Feel so lost. So all alone. Tell me about the geck, bitch. Where which hide it? Where where's the geck? Where did you put the gecko? The Garden of Eden creation kit. It was for terraforming. For restoring the world after a nuclear disaster. Unstable technology. And ultimately boring. <laughs> boring? Why the old reality when instead you could create any reality you choose. Okay, uh, but still, do you know any vaults that have them? Oh, yeah, right. Where's my father? Shit, I forgot. <laughs> He's been right here the whole time, and you were too dense to figure it That's out. That's the dog, I know. The dog, you see. 
Man's best friend. But now you've taken all my friends from me. Yep. Yeah. Can I get him back? Tell me about this place tranquilly then. Tell me exactly who you are, who you really are. So I'm free to leave. I leave now. now. Oh really? I still I still can't kill ya? You can't do that here. Why? And now you have to pay. God damn it, not again. <laughs> Dog. Hello, hello, doggy. Papa. Papa. <laughs> Good doggy, papa. <laughs> For good measure, hit the dog. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> you can't do that here. Papa. It's you. Papa. Papa. You saved me. I was afraid I'd be trapped in there forever. Oh, it's so good to see you, but what are you doing here? I'm saving you, Papa! Well, I'm glad you did. This certainly wasn't how I expected things to turn out. I wasn't ready for Braun, or I might have fared better. Good thing I showed up to save you. Uh, one question, why did you voluntarily enter one of these pods? Don't see why you would ever you know, choose to do with that. Good thing I showed up to save ya. It certainly is. The game it's ends now, no. That I'm on two legs again. And thanks to Dr. Braun, I know that Project Purity isn't lost after all. There's like a good 10 hours left. 10, 15 hours left. Well, what did you learn, Father? I was right about Braun. The technology he developed is unstable, even dangerous. But it can be adapted for Project Purity. I need to return to Rivet City and talk with Madison. If we can find a Gek, we can make Project Purity work. So that's that's the next stop, finding a Gek, a uh, Gecko. So I'm going back to Rivet City right now. Yes. With what I've learned, Madison is sure to see that we can finally succeed where we failed so many years ago. I'd like you to come with me. I'd like you to be there when we finally open the floodgates. Wait, isn't that a good thing? Purifying water, that's a good thing, right? Mm. I'm not going with you, I have other things to take care of. Nah, let's go to Rivet City, sure. That's my girl. Let's hurry. Now that I know what we need, I want to get back to work as soon as possible. Did you manually activate the DLC? No, when I exited the vault, it gave me a bunch of notifications. Is that, is that right? Did I do that correctly? <laughs> Yeah, can we just talk for him? I don't care. What exactly is Project Purity? I mean, Dr. Lee basically told me it's a water purification thing. But I want to hear it out of your mouth, Papa. It started as an idea, really. Remember the Bible passage your mother loves so much? Free, clean water for everyone. What a difference it could make in the lives of everyone here in the Wastes. Over time, that idea took the form of a purifier. Not like the one in the vault, though. This one was gigantic, capable of purifying millions of gallons of water. Liters. We used the old Jefferson Memorial for the location, right on DC's tidal basin. Someday soon, I hope you'll see it work. Oh, you're back, Mr. Courier. Oh, welcome back. You've, you've missed the end of Tranquility Lane. Damn. Okay, so purifying water. That's your big... That, that's... I mean, couldn't you just use the Gek to turn DC into a nice livable area wouldn't that make so much more sense than just purifying the water that's like i give you a fire truck and a burning fire a house on fire and you decide to take the fire truck drive it to the shop and buy a liter of water to pour that onto the fire i feel like that's what you're doing with that How did mom die? I understand that you have reason to question a good many things I've told you over the years. But your mother... I've never lied to you about what happened. Not once. She died giving birth to you. Shit. It was a difficult time. She was so eager to meet you, to make a place for you in the world. If nothing else, please believe that she loved you very much. 
He killed me, that's why I'm inactive. Oh, Lorelia's finger bottom. Finger bottom, figure bottom. <laughs> it's just the best name in the world. Lorelia's figure bottom. So she died because my head is too thick. Okay, that sucks. Well, let's go. Be careful, sweetie. That's me. Oh! Speech. Bro, you said speech 75. I just put it to 50. Good enough. Uh, repair. Melee weapons. Yep. Nice. What else do we have? Strong back. I don't really matter. I don't matter. <laughs> it doesn't. I was going to say it doesn't matter. Lorelius kidnapped at me and just and you just escaped. Nice. Welcome back. <laughs> uh I don't think there are any new ones here. Comprehension. Child at heart. No, I'm not gonna be nice to children. I kinda wanna go little eager again. I'll just get to 75 and you get to do the funny. Yeah, it's just one more. No, well, two more. Get child at heart? Okay. I've never taken it before because I don't like children. Will this in any way, shape, or form stop me from selling Brian to slavers? <laughs> child at heart. No, it won't. Okay, perfect. Oh! Bye!